Hi guys, and welcome to this very exciting video. Today, I will be showing a time-lapse of my art submission for SLU's Community Art Contest. To make things even better, 1000 is the guest judge, and if you don't know who either of them are, I will link them down below so you can check out their awesome channels. But for now, let's get started. The prompt given is to create and design a new character. It's actually quite broad, which gave me quite a lot of space to freestyle and improvise. I'm quite late into this challenge, so I've already seen some of the masterpieces submitted, and I definitely saw quite a lot of fantasy alien type characters out there, which is awesome, but I wanted to create a more relatable character, maybe someone we've met or worked with, or even just someone that makes you think, yeah, that's me, yeah, I've been that guy. So here we have Jeff. Jeff is a data analyst. He'll have you know he went to art school, but found out he couldn't make a living that easily. So he ended up doing what most of us do, getting a steady nine to five that pays enough to make art after hours. The thing is Jeff works with a bunch of ding dongs who never think outside the box. So every time a problem comes up, they keep making the same mistakes, but expecting different results. And because he's so artistic and creative, he usually comes up with some really good solutions, even though they might seem a little unconventional at first. Nobody ever seems to listen to him, and he gives up, thinking, all of his colleagues are idiots. Honestly, you just don't understand how frustrated he gets. What Jeff doesn't understand is that nobody likes him, because he's always so condescending when he comes up with solutions, so everybody ignores him, and thus the cycle continues. I think we've all met or worked with people like Jeff, and we've all been Jeff at some points in our lives, so that's what I wanted this character to be. You can tell he's given up on just about everything, but somehow that gives him the right amount of depression to come home and make more art. I've had so much fun creating this guy, and I'm so grateful for this contest because otherwise he wouldn't exist. Usually I get really stressed or feel like my art isn't at the right level when I join a contest, but this time I did exactly what was asked, to have fun with it. And if I'm being completely honest, this is the once in a lifetime opportunity to have Slew and 1000, two of my favorite artists on YouTube, to lay their eyeballs on my art, so that alone makes it all worth it. I've been following them way before I even decided to start a channel, and they're definitely a huge source of inspiration when it comes to creating art. So I will link them down below. Please go and check out their channel. I know you're gonna love it. And I hope you guys enjoy this video. I'll see you all next week. Bye.